Bandit taking advantage of bad roads to kidnap Nigerians. Sultan of Sokoto, and which is very correct. They are taking advantage of bad leaders. Wicked people to do evil to Nigerians. And let's still tell ourselves the truth. All the blame should not just go to the federal government alone. The question is, what are these governors doing with a huge amount of location that is coming to them every month? What are they doing with the money? Because right now, it's just centered on the federal government. Federal government, Tunubu, 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 Tunubu. What are these state governments doing? At least you could still do something. You understand? The Sultan of Sokoto and President General of Nigerian Supreme Council for Islamic Affairs, Mohammed Sadi Abubakar the Third, has decried that the deplorable state of Nigeria wrote are aiding activities of bandits and kidnappers. Sultan, who made the observation in Ilila local government area on Thursday, when President Bola Tinubu flagged off the 168 uh, KV Sokoto boundary superhighway, a kilometer I meant to say, uh, superhighways also urged the president to consider construction of railways in states that have none and uh, revive all the rail transportation. Bandits and other bad elements in Nigeria are taking advantage of our bad roads, hence the need to expedite actions on the road. The Sultan further urged President Tinubu to also pay attention to the plight of Nigerians, adding that the welfare of the people should be a top priority as well. All road projects are very important, but the welfare of Nigerians should equally be considered very seriously, as it is very important for leaders to also see to the welfare of their people. On the Sokoto Badagri Road project, the Sultan also stressed that he will personally monitor the project, adding that the Sokoto Zamfara Road is equally very important to avoid bandits taking advantage of the road of the bad road to kidnap innocent and uh, road users. Empower the state governors to ensure that the roads that pass through their states are completed in good time and construction of railway, the, the length and breadth of Nigeria will preserve the, the lifespan of road. Harden Sokoto deserve a rail line to other parts of Nigeria, which is very good. And uh, I don't know why they did not even, you know, let uh, the former president of Nigeria uh, to know about this. That is important. When he was busy, you know, uh, constructing railway from Nigeria to Niger, they said nothing about it. What is not just a talk, eh? and I will continue to say this, until we Nigerians, we understand that this tribalism of a thing is a very big disease that, uh, that has actually eaten this country so bad. We're not going to move forward if we not realize that it's a very bad disease, tribalism and religion. All these things would have also be very cool if they have warned the former president of Nigeria the money when it take go construct do, those railway from Nigeria to Niger, it, it don't it don't build how many railway from like how many states in Nigeria today. You understand all those ones now today is wasted because all his plan he not come work. He was thinking that it's not that he was thinking. He said after his regime he's going to run to Niger Republic, but right now he's caged in Nigeria. After the, the, the army took over, you know, the uh, uh, government democratically elected a uh, uh, president in Niger. So you see, people think that they are smart, but they don't know God is smarter. You understand? God is smarter. 
good and fine. Our leaders are not trying. But sometimes when these things are happening, we should not look because the person is from your region. You don't want to talk. You are not talking. You don't want to talk. It's only when the person, when we say, well, I don't get another person from another region, then you now start speaking. People will now start understanding that, ah, these people, they gave voice. This thing will not help anybody. Well, I don't drop out for you. What he said is truth. The bad road is actually aiding kidnappers and bandits to kidnap innocent Nigerians, so, which is very correct. You understand? That is very correct. So at the drop I'm here, I beg, uh, help us share this video. Let it go viral. Let Nigerians understand what is happening today in the Nigerian political landscape. Thank you and bye for now.